bad. Right. That was swell. Uh, have any either of my ships taken damage? Nope. So, uh, I think my turn is done. I can't think of anything else to do, so... Yeah. Oh, it's you. Ah, uh, yeah, now I remember why I'm making so fucking much money. <laughs> Did you have an event or something? Uh, yeah, I've got the... Uh, industrial bake breakthrough hanging there for another five turns. <laughs> okay. So that would be plus twenty five percent from industrial buildings. That that'll do it. <laughs> that would do it. <laughs> I might have overlooked that a bit. <laughs> eh, happens. Okay, this this is going to take a. Uh, that's a lot of time to uh, convert to pro imperial. Is one hundred percent pro pro shogun. Yeah. Yeah. Oh well, I'll, I'll spend that time upgrading it, uh, um, building it up to a large town, uh, getting some the port and maybe the copper uh, mine to yeah, a better like a plan. shape. Okay, I've got six standing basically stand by money there so bombard ooh broke force rest that's nice ships where's the other navy no, the administration cost isn't yet anything uh, anything like even slightly annoying, 7.7%. I was just thinking about um, going with the clan, uh, clan development to central reforms that give me a 13% reduction on administration cost, but yeah, 7.7%. Yeah. Yeah. No points. See how that would be a kind of a whatever. Okay. I've got 16 troops in my main army, still not a full stack. But, well, that's what you get when you don't do infantry. Mm. I suppose. Also, you got uh, quality instead of quantity. I don't see yeah. many Levi, Levi units. Yeah, I, Levi. I don't think I've bought, like, I've bought that one Levi infantry for his end when it wasn't on bad standing on the oh, yeah. rest. Uh, do you have 300 that you could spare? Oh, sure. I could you, like get it back start mm -hmm. for your next turn, but I, ooh, I can do trades. I can do trades. Yay! Mm. Um, now to find somebody I could oh, actually hey. possibly... Oh, Yonago. Friendly. Hey, oh. exporting 100 percent of my copper and 100 percent of my tea i can upgrade everything and gain insane amounts of money your nago goes with trade agreement period that works <laughs> <laughs> now i really I, hmm? but I was supposed to ask for where are you now there you yeah. are satsuma I can spare Thank that you. much. Thank you. And I'll just go down to his... No, wait. Now I realize why the uh, AI built this barracks here in this in Bungo. Because the copper uh, mine gives you minus X percent uh, cost for modern units, so... Ooh, that is nice. Yeah. After I upgrade this, I'll get like minus 15 percent. Because 5 from tech and 10 from uh, buildings, so... That is good. You might have some sharpshooters in your near future. That is that is very, very good. It'll take another five turns for my artillery academy to roll around. But after that, um, 
pretty soon awesome guns. But I'm at zero money, full army movement, full fleet movement, agents in armies or in cities. Oh, we're done. They aren't all that uh, different, actually, from just regular line infantry. Slightly uh, fewer numbers, like uh, 120 yeah, instead of 200. The, the biggest thing is that they've got that extended range. Yeah, 25 points more range. Yeah, and they're... Okay, Kumamoto wants peace again. Yeah, I just told him no. Yeah, with the bat. Just, just decline. I, I think somebody might have... No, but nobody's at war with Josai. So there's no reason why their ship would have sunk. <laughs> I'm really worried about that ship. Yeah, the ghost ship is is haunting us. Yeah, it, it disappeared somewhere around there. And I haven't seen it since. Yeah. Uh, my ships are almost around there now. Simple, whatever. Yeah, they uh, they acted already. <laughs> I haven't seen the ship. I'm thinking, uh, like, might it be somewhere around the? Oh, <laughs> oh for the love of Pete! No, I'm not going to accept peace. He'll probably ask you next. No, he didn't. Oh, weird. Yeah. Hey, there goes my foreign veteran and geisha, and uh, some assholes broke their trade agreement with me. Oh, that sucks. Uh, would you, uh, do you want to take care of those two extra dudes yeah, just wandering I'll about? Yeah, I'll go smack there. Cool. Okay, well. Whether you bunghole were, uh, let's actually check. Matsue. I'm not going to have trade agreements with you ever again. Ah, oh, Matsue, it's up there by Izumo, right next to Toyoka. Why did they do that? They are pro-emperor, they are very friendly. I think it might have been... Are they at war with Toyoka? Uh, they are at war with pretty much everyone. It's Kumamoto, Toyoka, Iwakuni and uh, undiscovered clan Tsuwano. Yeah, yeah, I think those guys are gonna die. <laughs> yeah, looks like. Although they do have a really big army stack there, so they will at least give uh, the uh, Toyoka yeah, they have a port uh, available so they didn't break it because they lost uh, no, no it's the only space. province uh, you don't know what's going on there mm. I need to go fishing for a new uh, trade agreement then uh, let's go try to Toyoka again since they are on a roll you are here, like an honest man will you do yeah, you'll do a thousand. Will you do five hundred? Yeah, you'll do five hundred. Will you do two fifty? Yeah, you'll do two fifty. Will you do one fifty? Yeah, you'll do. Will you do like fifty? <laughs> Jesus Christ! You'll take pretty much anything as long as I give you something. Okay, it's between te uh, 25 and 50 Koku. I guess I can give you 50 Koku for a trade agreement. <laughs> <laughs> silly, silly sod. Oh, and I can actually have one more, because I uh, just took uh, Bungo and repaired the port. So, um, mm, what you are worth 130. And uh Oh hey, Pro Emperor. One thirty. Yonago. Uh I don't remember. Yeah, yeah I asked. Yeah, I, I just started a trade agreement with those guys, so they're, they're Hey, I can actually demand payment from them uh for getting a trade agreement. Uh you might not want to do that, that affects your diplomatic stand pretty badly. Uh I just want to see how uh, they are willing to give me like 500. <laughs> nah, I'm good. I'll just give you a uh, great agreement, no strings attached. And that's all. Cool beans. 2,500 income, unfortunately. So it went down from 3,000 because uh, trade got 
whacked somehow. Yeah, but it should rise up a bit again after the trade mm. rises up. So. True. Uh, so, still here. Uh, you should be happy with two points in just a moment. And I can only do like f uh, subsistence farming bits all over all over here. But here I can actually upgrade to a large town, which is very much something I'd like to do in Bungal. Since I'll be sitting on this province for a little while anyway, I might as well uh, upgrade it as much as I can in the meantime. Yeah. Uh, so if you want to get rid of some of your ships, I'd be more, more than willing to take them off your hands around this time. Okay, if you want to, you know, not take them for a few turns, I can keep on running them around until that industrial play industrial breakthrough oh. ends. So sure, so it's not like I need them yet for anything. And they're actually, you know, all the way around Tosa right now. <laughs> They'll be coming around the next turn. I'll just do a little spin around the. Oh hey, my f foreign veteran actually changes uh, like a uh, tiny picture. Seth yeah, Patrick. Yeah, he does. <laughs> he, they, uh, all, all of the guys nowadays change. In right. So now I have three points, mm. so I can do uh, resolve when training troops and campaign movement range, and uh, resolve in military administration and uh, ammunition for all units in this man's army That's nice. and I'm still left with one point that I can use uh, to get so I'm training troops or oh, do I want to go for the soldier as well for getting the sharpshooter no I really don't need sharpshooter marksmanship wouldn't be bad though but it's behind sharpshooter so it's me yeah. So when training troops charge bonus for all units in this agent's army. Mm, resolve in military administration. <laughs> huh. Oh well, I'll uh, just stick to those two for now. Uh, Colt 36 Navy Revolver. Chance of being assassinated goes down and chance to killing enemy in self-defense goes up. <laughs> or Scottish uh. Tourist. Minus 7% per <laughs> campaign movement range and minus 5% of chance of being assassinated. Hmm. Hmm, I wonder. <laughs> Swords? Swords are for English girls. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, yeah, le le let's, let's go with the Colt Navy. <laughs> He has two pistols. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, I, I wish you luck if you want to get rid of this dude. There's 10% extra chance of killing the dude who's going to try and kill him, and yeah, 10% less chance of uh, actually being killed. Yeah. <laughs> Should work. Inspiring troops, performing. Um, da -da -da -da. Inspiring troops, troops, restricting armies. Yeah, I think I'll save the point for my geisha as well. So yeah, that's my turn done. Yes, I am indeed aware that it is autumn, but thank you for telling me, game. <laughs> Ooh, stuff done. Like cottage industry at his end. That's good. 
actually do the cotton weaving shed there, which would give me the most growth per turn. Although it would drain my coffers, but money is money. <laughs> <laughs> and I really don't see any use other for my money than, you know, making more money <laughs> at the moment. Yep. Since Jukushi is already creating that large town. Generally, like long term, it's never a bad idea to just up your income as much as possible. Yeah, the administration costs and whatnot will come back and bite you eventually, so... Yep. Once the uh, empire starts uh, growing in size, ooh, it's... Ooh, ooh, somebody. Ah, crap to meet. <laughs> this is new Daimyo, but I had walked my full length already. If he doesn't go into the town, I might smack his ass. <laughs> Actually, screw that noise, I'll just keep on going. I've got places to be. And is not doing nothing with just his Daimyo without any yeah, backup it units. It does cause some interesting stuff to the clan if you keep on killing the time you know. True. They might just suddenly decide, okay, the these uh this whole family is utterly useless. <laughs> yeah, we're so ding done. <sighs> well, uh it seems that the ghost ship is indeed uh, the ghost ship and has a uh, ghost in a way to the ghost lands of ghostiness. Yeah. Because Josai still not at war with anyone but the ship's not here yeah jesus h christ i just take took a look at my vassal like, he's been doing nothing except building up his fort <laughs> it's one turn away from being a castle <laughs> that's <laughs> awesome well he does have a field artillery school and barracks yeah Talk about turtle turtling up like. <laughs> hey, he's, he's like the vassal of a guy that goes around punching everybody in the <laughs> face. True. I do that too. <laughs> uh, anyway, um, I've got almost no money and not really a lot to do. Look to me like I'm done. Yep. <laughs> but yeah, I. Honestly, I wouldn't want to try and get that particular city uh, if he just th if that's just what he's going to be doing for the rest of the game, like building up his uh, fortress and recruiting quality troops. <laughs> mm. I mean, sure, you could be able, I would, or bleh, you'd be able to do it for certain. It's just that, like, to get a through one full stack of uh, fully upgraded city with yeah. much walls, you need like double the numbers. I was kind of not looking again. Did that Jose ship turn out somewhere? It actually it it, it did 180 and just went away. It's okay. I I think I saw it around Key somewhere. I'll actually check around a bit. I've got time. Okay. Assume he should be happy now. Yeah, happiness of two points. I like that. And uh, such. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's all the way around to Izu at the moment. Uh, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's here. <laughs> Goddamn snake. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Well, at least I drove around a bit. <laughs> now I'll just need to bring my navy around to the conquest of... Oh, for fuck's sake, Kumamoto just took the province of Aoki. Hmm? Yeah, Kumamoto now er owns this place. How? I they don't even want to know. They <laughs> they're at war with Iwakumi, Iwakuni and probably... No, wait. But they don't have any ships. How'd they get there? 
No clue. That's really weird. Okay, uh, let me check something, because I can... Mm. I think I have the troops to uh, take Buzan quite easily, considering it's basically There's got nothing in nothing. it. Yeah. So, if I just leave uh, some dudes here... Can I... He'll have a two more dudes. port in three turns. Okay. Hey, where, did, where did he move his troops? Did you check which bush? Uh, I th I think northwards. I think it's like here ish, like yes. uh, in the forests around this area. Okay. Yeah, it looked like he was backing uh, towards his uh, city. Okay. Mm. Well, I'll actually leave them for you. They're your problem now. <laughs> You might want to bring your ships around and just start bombarding Buzan. Yeah, I'll need to fiddle around with my troops a bit here. Because I want to have just like, everyone in here. Ah, except crap. Now Bungo is again being pissy because uh, which which one of my dudes actually gives them the uh oh hey uh I think the Ishin Shishi is the one that's uh yeah yeah Ishi Ishi Ishin Shishi is the one that r puts repression in the towns you really should leave him there also he gives them the b uh, conversion bonus. bonus yeah yeah oh I'll just uh I'll I'll grab these guys and uh, run the Ishin Shishi back there next turn because he j magically ran out of movement by attaching himself to the army. Yeah. So I'll uh, bring him back next turn. Right now I can easily just leave all these uh, levy units just hanging about there. Uh, the um, non-clan allegiance and all that jazz should start going down soonish. Resistance to invaders at least goes down at the same pace as non clan allegiance rises for the time being, so. And uh, I, that should give me surveillance next turn, and then I can go to seclusion, and when that's done, I can just relax a whole heck of a lot with, <laughs> with uh, dealing uh, with all that uh, unhappiness. Uh, Uh, Adavara and Josai, they can get trades with uh, you guys. You had the courage to come before me, but speak now that you're here. Yeah, Josai just don't, not interested in the slightest. And mm, with Matsue, uh, yeah, with Matsue, I'm not even going to try because they broke it already once. Yeah. Okay, and Odawara, uh, if I give them a thousand, we might come to an agreement, so mm, no. <laughs> Not going to give you like five turns worth of income that I'd get from the trade agreement just to get said trade agreement. Not gonna happen. Shinobi increases in rank. Foreign veteran increases in rank. Yeah. I'm gonna send my dudes out into the woods and see if oh, I. Oh crap. Oh fucking fuck. He actually. Oh. Okay, that's a retreat. Uh, uh, it's definitely a retreat. Except I can't retreat. Uh, I mean, from the battle map, like, just run the hell away from I the can't. ambush. I can't, it's an ambush. Well, fudge. I guess we're gonna go fight it then. <laughs> I might end up the cavalry. Yeah. Well, it's... Oh, for fuck's fuck. <laughs> yeah, the placement with these ambushes is always kinda 
Yeah, yeah. Bishes are always. I thought that you could uh, force a re retreat once you get to the actual battle map. Not even from, from ambushes, nope. Crap. From ambush. That's really, it's really shitty. Yeah, yeah, it's funny that he actually got to ambush me there. Mm. Since I kind of knew where he went.